in Texas, scores of children taken from a polygamous sect will return to their parents starting next week. The children were seized by the state over abuse concerns at their West Texas compound, but the Texas Supreme Court ruled officials overstepped their authority in taking more than 400 children. Now, under a draft agreement released in court, parents can get their children back with the proper identification and a pledge to take parenting classes. They must remain in Texas. The agreement was reached with 38 mothers of 124 children who filed the complaint against the state. But the deal will affect nearly all of the children since they were seized under the same circumstances. Texas authorities have also collected DNA swabs from polygamous sect leader Warren Jeffs, part of an ongoing criminal investigation that's separate from the custody dispute. A search warrant for the DNA alleges that Jeffs had so-called spiritual marriages with four girls ages 12 to 15. Jeffs is revered as a prophet among sect members. He's in jail in Arizona awaiting trial on abuse charges. Officials say removing the children was necessary to end a cycle of abuse at the ranch in rural West Texas. They say teenage girls were forced to marry and have sex with older men. Parents deny any abuse, saying they are being persecuted for their religious beliefs. Lee Powell, The Associated Press.